Hi everyone, Kathy here. I wanted to share with you all, I went to the Dollar Tree today and I picked up a few things and I have a, I have a couple um, projects I wanted to share with you after I do my Dollar Tree haul. So, um, cause some of the projects that I did, I worked on them with some Dollar Tree items. So with that said, by the way, it's Monday. Yay, I'm glad it's almost over. Um, it hasn't been a good Monday. But anyway, so I'm going to share with you what I picked up at the Dollar Tree. Some really cute stuff that I wanted to share with you guys. The first thing, I don't know if you all have found these or not, but these are print your own labels. And look how cute these labels are. Love the shapes of them. And I think I'm going to put some of these on my boxes here in my craft room. And look how cute. I mean, and they're pretty big. Um, let's see. I... I did what I say that nobody should do. I opened one of the packages over there just to see how they looked. Doesn't really say on the outside, but they are pretty nice size. So that's this style. And then I also found this style. Look how cute those are. And you can uh, print your own information on them. Isn't that cute? So, and each pack has um, 240 labels. So for a dollar, that's a good deal. So, and they're made by Polaroid, which is a pretty good brand. So that is my labels. And then I picked up one of these vinyl tablecloths because I have a little project I wanna make with this. And it's pretty big too, it's 54 by 108. So even if I cut it in half, I think I have a big enough piece to put on my um, patio all back. Um, I picked up two of these alpha blocks and I'm not going to use them of course as alpha blocks but um, when I create my project I will show you what I'm going to use them for. So I picked up two boxes of these and they have nine in each box. So it's not too bad. Most are pretty cute. And then um, I picked up, okay you ready for this? I picked up the pineapple glasses. Okay. those are my glasses now of course I'm not going to use those as glasses and you're going to see the cutest project I'm going to make with these so yeah these are my pineapple glasses so you can see me look my pineapple glasses okay so and if that's not enough my shell bikini top Yes, it's a bikini top, and no, I'm not going to be wearing it because I don't want to be responsible for anybody dying um, if I wore this bikini top. But you get two shells in here, and I'm going to show you a project that I already finished. I bought two packs of these, and I'm going to show you the project that I did with these shells. So keep in mind, it's a bikini top, so there's two in here. But again, I'm not wearing it as a bikini top, trust me. Um, these are just some pins. I needed some pins. And then I want to show you these adorable, these are um, ice cream bowls. But look, there's eight in here. And I don't know if you can see them or not. They come with a little spoon and everything, but they're like a scallop shaped bowl. I have an idea for these. So I bought two packages of those. And they're plastic, like a hard plastic. And there's... Um, Oh no, there's four bowls and four spoons. That's why it makes it eight pieces. So I picked up those. And then I picked up these two um, duct tapes. Look, this one here, look how cute with the little glasses. And then this one here. And I've seen like the, the um, gift bags and stuff with this one, but I've never seen the tape. So I thought those were cute. And then um, finally, I picked up some of these little notepads because I'm going to take them apart and I'm going to alter these and I picked up four of these because I'm going to make some for a couple of friends and I'm going to send it out to them so that is what I picked up at the Dollar Tree and let me see how much time do I have I might have time to show you um, what I made with these shells let me just show you real quick hold on, hold on so this is one of my projects that I made with the shells and I made like a little jewelry box. 
and I'm going to line the inside. I just painted it for now. And what I did is I got the two shells. I put a little hinge on here that I had in my stash and I painted it. But because this is kind of, um, it's plastic and it's kind of like slippery, I first um, gessoed the whole thing and then I painted it and then I uh, distressed it a little bit to make it look like a shell. And I uh, did the edges with my gold ink pen. I put the little um, feet on here, little pearl feet. And then I just did like a little, um, like a little, I don't know, like shells and some flowers and stuff on there with a little piece of lace. And then I did the little pull up here with a little piece of lace I made into a flower with a little uh, pearl. And what I'm going to do is I'm going to line the inside. And you see where the, the holes are? That's why I said I hadn't finished it yet. I'm going to put a little chain on here so when she opens it, it'll stay kind of like this. And her room is all done in nautical, so I thought this would be a cute little jewelry piece for on top of her um, dresser. Isn't that cute? And that is with my bikini top. Mm -hmm, my bikini top. This is it. Isn't that adorable? And it's like a little jewelry case. There you go. And it says perfectly. Oh, you can't see, but it, it sits perfectly. And I, like I said, I'm where those four holes are, it, the chain is going on there. Like from here to here, and I'm going to um, line it. So yeah, I think she'll like that. Isn't that pretty? So that's what I made with the bikini top. And then the last thing that I wanted to share with you all, which I think I still have time. Um, I'm going to a graduation Saturday. And I had to make a graduation card. And he is graduating from a very honorable college with an awesome degree. And I made him this, this graduation card. And I had this sticker here. It's fab. It's actually a fabric um, cap and gown. And I made it on this color paper. And then I layered black, gold, and cream. I had a little uh, sticker that said graduation on there with like a little diploma and then I made a little banner here and put 2016 on there and then the inside I just put a little um, it looks like a little what do you call those things um, this is congratulations with honors because he is graduating with honors and a little diploma and then I put a little piece of washi tape here in the golden black and I'm just gonna write him a little message now I need some help I need to know what I can buy or what can I give a 28 year old graduate if you all watch this video please send me some ideas because I have absolutely no idea and I am kind of stumped at, as to what to get so that is it for right now I will be back I'm gonna be having some more projects for you and that's it. So again, thank you for watching and bye for now.